Good morning, afternoon, or evening, everyone. My name is Elavaris, and welcome back to the Battle for Wesnoth, specifically the Under the Burning Suns campaign. Last time, we were on our way into the mountains, but in order to get there, we have to go through a bunch of various orcish tribes. Now, we cleared out the group around here without too much hassle. We got some good level ups, if I recall correctly. Uh, actually, did we? We had two advancements, Kenoth Champion and a Pathfinder. We've gotten a whole bunch of XP. Our Sun Sylph is getting close to leveling. We're getting our Kenoth Druid up there, our Red Mage. We're getting Nim going. She's getting very adept at the sword, uh, which is pretty cool to see. Um, yeah, she's lawful, right? Yeah, she's lawful. So this is just like neutral damage, which is kind of crazy. So, yeah, she's doing some serious work right now. And uh, yeah, we're just pushing in. We're going to see how things go. This might be a little bit of a shorter episode today because um, I don't have like a ton of time uh, to record. But um, it's all right. We're going to make the best of it. So if I recall correctly, we were pretty much done. You go 12 through 8, 4. Yeah, okay. I'll take that. And we're going to remember to move these guys. We're not going to go in for that because this guy just might take a little bit too much damage. Might end up dying, which is not what we want. Bring our Torok up a bit. All right, let's get going. Okay, big heals. It's the nice thing about the Sun Sylph is she can just kind of move over this terrain very easily and just come in and blast this guy. Well, she was supposed to blast him. Ugh, these tunnels are pitch black. It's as bad as fighting in a moonless night and it stinks of orc filth. I can hardly think of a place I would less like to go into. We have no choice. We cannot cross over these mountains, so we must go beneath them. If the orcs skulk in their tunnels and block our way, we must enter their dark places and fight them, no matter what the conditions. Remember, Calais, it's nasty fighting underground. We will be at a disadvantage against orcs and other things that prefer the darkness. Also, any time you find a particularly tough orc blocking a passage, my fireballs can blast him quick enough. Okay, yeah. Wolf Rider, eh? Let's move out a little bit. Not going to be great terrain for us elves, but that's okay. You're going to come up this way, so you're still getting healed. Bring the Red Mage in this way. Then hopefully Sun Sylph is just going to wreck this fool next turn anyways. I want to focus on leveling the Druid before the Dust Devil. Twelve two, twelve two. Don't really like that. So he could actually get like just straight up die if we get particularly unlucky. Bruh. Not if he goes here though. Let's go twelve three. Actually, that was a mistake. Should have gone eight four. Well. Well, let's get you some damage in then. Wow, this guy's really good at dodging, eh? What the heck? Get some healing there. Kind of blocked up at this pass for a little bit. You can come northwards. Alright, there we go. Okay, he's going that way. Ooh, okay. Yep, he's taking some damage. Which way should the Sun Sylph be going? Because this guy could come in here and do an 8 2. Maybe we'll let Kalei come and take this guy out. I like that idea. Do a 9 2. How do you keep missing? How do all of you guys suck so much? Oh my gosh. All right, you can do it, right? Beautiful. So she physically can't be killed because they can only get one person next to her, which is nice. All right, Nim, let's get in here. Bolas. 
Frick. Well. At least you can actually hit someone. At a little bit of a impasse here, you're going to come back this way. Get some more magic support. I've got you here if needed. Where'd the healer go? Healer's up here, right. Maybe that's not a... Uh, yeah. We need to heal the healer, or else she's going to get close to dying. Yep, that hurts. Yep. Nice! Yeah, he wouldn't be able to die. That's good. Nice thing about these guys is they've got such high resistances. Finally, it's daytime. Right, Clay, let's get you a hit in here. Beautiful. Okay. Nim. Big clap coming in. Very nice. And then she can get up here, which is awesome. Yep, 8-4. Beautiful. Very close to leveling now. Big heals. Sun Sylph up. You know what? I was going to say maybe I should move the Sun Sylph, but... That's okay. Yeah, definitely a pile-up going on over here. Ten two. that's a good kill for you. You're gonna go this way, here and here. We're just gonna let this guy take some hits. No need to, like, straight up rush. We're making huge money right now, which is nice. Gotta keep these gold supplies high. Get some good XP. Alright, there we go. Alright. Ooh, this guy's clapping now. He's going to do so much damage. Beautiful. That means you... <gasps> Crap. She's not able to walk in there. Dang it. Well, let's get you the XP then. It's okay. Okay. Bolas? That's fine. You're able to get a kill next turn then. No, actually, you want to move there so you're getting healed a little bit at least. Let's take a look at what we have. Sun Sylph coming in. That's going to be really nice, actually, to have a Sun Sylph. Maybe we get we focus on leveling her, too. We'll see if we can level them up, or level her up, so we get another Illumination. Because we definitely do want Illumination. That's going to be a huge thing in these tunnels. So we're going to get you to get this kill. We're gonna get you to do some damage. And we're gonna get you to get this kill. You're gonna come in here with an 8 3. And you're gonna miss all of them, just like we planned. Still got a little bit of a pile up here. But that's okay. Nope. You're gonna go to here. You're gonna go here. Okay, an Orcish Assassin. Oh, rip. You can get poisoned. Orcish Warrior. Okay, that's not the end of the world. You know, you can be healed if you get poisoned. 
Maybe he'll do some good retaliatory damage even if he gets poisoned. Gosh, look at that animation. That's so cool. The hair, the dress, oh my word. Whoever did the art for this knocked it out of the park. That is unreal. Yep. Beautiful. That's actually really good. Well. well, only one of these guys is going to get the kill, so we'll see if you can't, if you can get it, and you can get it instead. Oh, they're literally right here. Okay. Shouldn't have moved you that far back. One hit? Yep. Beautiful. Okay. Is there anything like in the water up here? Doesn't look like it, just deep water. Need to get healed. Just kind of bottlenecked. Oh, I'm moving away, are they? This animation's just so cool. Looks like he's got a steady income, at least. Now you want to get healed a bit. You up here, you're going to be a blocker. You're going to beat the other blocker. Oh, wait. No, you don't like caves. You're going to go here then. You're going to be the healer over here. There we go. Hitting that N key. Make sure we didn't miss anyone. Oh. Clay, I am Death Incarnate, and I shall avenge all those you have killed. Wait a second. Um. Oh. Boys. Oh my word, that's so bad. 8 4. You're gonna level. Ooh, I cannot shide. Frick, this is bad. That's so bad. Well, he's really low. He could get killed by anyone he attacks. Hmm. <laughs> That's not what we like, boys. It's not what we like at all. Alright, two hits. percent defense. I'm just gonna bring Torok Rider up here. Don't want to risk anything. Down here on the other hand, uh, <laughs> Fudge.
Well. That fudging sucks. Let's do it. I promise we shall meet again. Frick's sake, dude. He literally came in here. Mucked my poor guy. Ugh. That fudging sucks. That guy was loyal too. We have one other one, thankfully. Well, we'll have to make do, I suppose. Chances you actually kill this guy are pretty slim. Chances you actually hit him are also pretty slim, apparently. 96 out of 100. Yeah, I mean... You just go for a hit, get some XP. You can go in for this. Perfect. Yeah, the going in for the bulls was probably a risky play. But I went for it because I was hoping that he wouldn't be able to kill someone. And he was probably going to kill someone if I didn't go for it. So, sad. Thankfully, she was close to leveling. That's also some really freaking cool art as well. Enemy suffers 10% penalty both to their defense and chance to hit for one turn. I see. Interesting. Okay. Don't think I fully read what that did. I'm going to try and level this guy up too. just want to be really careful when I'm moving here because there's always a chance that someone just one taps a unit. Which is not what we like. Nice. Hmm. Just gonna put you there. Yeah, because this guy already just got blasted by damage. I wonder if we go in for the kill here. I think we do. She doesn't even need to kill. She probably won't. Oh. Nope. Nice, Nim. Let's do it. Beautiful. Look at all that XP. Bolas on this guy. Let's get a poison. Very nice. Oh, he just wanted to level her up. Teleport. I don't know. I want. I think I want to go Archmage since she level up again. Guess she doesn't actually have a ton of health. Okay, a bit of a pile up here. Gonna start moving along this way. Let's see if you can't get a few hits in. You can just straight up kill. We'll get Nim a kill on the other side, maybe. Actually, no, you can go farther now. Very nice. Ooh, no, there's a lot of villages over here. Cap. 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 
two hits. Very nice. Okay, so you physically cannot be killed. And you're close to leveling, which is awesome. Beautiful. And the poison doesn't take effect because she's right next to him. Which is very nice. So you're going to come over here. You could get poisoned in theory. You... Yeah, hmm. Very nice. 2 XP away. Beautiful. And yeah, then you're going to go here. Shide coming in the back. Stand aside, chaps. Saw that coming from a mile away. Yeah, nice try. You only need one XP. There we go. Sun Sylph coming in hot. Two hits. Alright, no hits apparently. Just complete roadblock up here. Go for it. Hmm. Not ideal. Hopefully the leader doesn't come out and just snipe her. Oh, she's 30% defense. I probably should have checked that. Mistakes were made. Yeah, leader doesn't like to move. Didn't want to move there, actually. Well, whatever. Easy kill. Okay, you want this kill. Let's go for another warrior. Five two magical, eh? And you can't get poisoned, so just go for this. Nice. Twelve, twenty-four, thirty-six. Three hits would kill. I wonder if you can go in for bolas. Nope. You physically cannot be killed, so you're just going to go in. You're going to sit here right next to this guy and taunt him. Okay. So, we bring Nim over here. Let's get her finish this guy off. Boom, big kill. Ooh, max HP, max XP plus 20%. Max XP. I mean, having actually it with bolas is nice. I'm going to go for Hunter. Because then we have another unit with bolas since we lost our last one. Which is okay. Now, who's getting this kill? Got a lot of level ups. You could try and get Kalei this kill. It's not a bad idea. Eight. 
16, 24. Nope. Okay. Um, oh, we could try and get the Dust Devil this kill, actually, now that I think about it. Go for a 10-3 here. It's unlikely he's going to hit all three. Three eight swarm. We'll bring Dust Devil in. We'll get Kalei the kill if Dust Devil can't get it. There we go. All right. Well, that's all of them then. Clear the path. Got two Sun Sylphs, which is really nice. Kalei, let's go. Maybe I'll just fly around. <gasps> oh. Grebo keeps shiny safe from nasty orcsies and specially stinking elves. Ho ho, look at that. And these guys can all fly. Let's go. Goon squad moving out. That's so funny. Freaking Grebo. Well. Sorry, Grebo. I wonder what that is. That's just a trash of... A treasure trove of coins, perhaps? Looks like he's been squirreling away his stolen loot in this cave. Not that he had much. Must be hard times. Oh, 100 gold. Okay. Oh no, you can go this way and investigate down here. It's kind of cool. Free 100 gold. Anything over here? Hard to say, not looking like much. Cool little hidden area, I'll say. Yep. That's it. This passage seems different from the other tunnels and caves. It is wide and smooth and leads sharply downwards. I bet this was the way that Elo was talking about. This is no natural passage, as the walls are too well carved and smooth to be made by orcs. I wouldn't be surprised if this was once carved out by dwarves. I wonder if there are any still left in these mountains. Now that you've found the way, we should be able to get the rest of our people past the orcs. It's odd. I guess we're trading the dangers we know for the dangers we don't. We really are putting our lives in Elo's palm. May she guide as well as she has before. I'll just be happy when I can breathe fresh air again and see the sun and stars. Still, who knows what we'll encounter deep under the earth. Well, there's only one way to find out. There we go. 700 gold on top of the defined minimum. That's what we like to see. Um, yeah, overall good scenario. Really freaking sucks that we lost that one Pathfinder towards the end, our poor loyal unit. But, you know, what can we say? Probably could have played that a little bit better, but that was a very unfortunate circumstance there. Kind of just caught me off guard, and it happens. We do have Bolas on Nim now, which is good. Um, but yeah, that's where... I think I'm going to leave it. So, didn't end up being that much of a shorter episode, actually. It's pretty much on par. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you all for watching. Made a lot of good progress here. We got six advancements. Archmage, Kenoth Champion, Pathfinder, Kenoth Sylph, Kenoth Sun Sylph, and a Sun Warrior, which is awesome. Is that, no, 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 not a Sun Warrior, just a Warrior. <laughs> yep. Yeah. So, yeah, looking pretty good. A lot of flying units which is really awesome for the terrain. We've got illumination. We got two units with illumination, which is really good for when we get, go into the caverns. So that's going to be really nice. We're going to have to make good use of that. And they're mobile. They can heal. 
very, very nice. So yeah, that's what we're going to call it. I'd like to thank you all for watching. Have a great rest of your day. Cheers, guys.